Hey, what's going on guys? Ben here from Runecraft PC and welcome to Road to Rebuild Episode 9. Wow, yeah, Episode 9. And uh, kicking it off with some Araxi kills. Look at them. I, I need those. No, don't search your body. Get those fucking bolts. I need them. I like those bolts. Um, so I'm going to structure it in the same way. I don't know how many Araxi kills I'm going to do today, but I may do 5 or 6, which is about my max, and then reset using a pheromone and do them again. Because uh, I really want that middle leg piece, so... Let's get this loot and then all the other loot after that I'm just going to put some music over it. Um, I'm going to start off with some magic logs but you know what those brews are nice, I'm happy with the brews. Hello, and it has been a while, and I mean a while since I last recorded live recording, uh, probably about four or five days now. So, as you just saw, I think that was roughly 25 to 30 Araxi kills right there. That has been over the last four or five days, and you saw the loot just wasn't very good. Uh, I'm very sorry, I wanted to put out a leg for you guys, or a weapon piece, but no, I got... Just general standard loot. Uh, if not, you know, kind of under average loot. I got one onyx balls drop, which you can see here, 117. Not even a high amount of them. No uncut onyx in almost 30 kills. That is killing me. That's horrible. It's usually like one in ten for me for uncut onyx. So let's see how much I made in almost 30 kills. 13.9 mil. Quite a pitiful amount. I'm pretty annoyed at that. Especially seeing as how much time it took me. Um, 
So, you know, it's not like I've just been logging in, doing a Raxi all day, and I got a Pheromone, which, you know, you'd think it'd be more than 13 mil, but oh well. Yeah, it's not like I've just been logging in, doing a Raxi all day, and then doing nothing else. No, I've actually been uh, doing a Raxi, doing Nex, uh, I haven't done any KK, mainly just a Raxi and Nex, and occasionally Bandos. Um, I've been swipping, swipping? <laughs> I've been swapping between those three bosses, and, um, I've been selling my next loot as I go, which is why my cash stack may have gone up a bit. And yeah, it just it hasn't gone well, uh, actually, put it that way. So, something I did, uh, decide to do. Someone commented on the last video, stop selling your, uh, selling and rebuying ascensions. And I know, I've already spoken about this before, it's horrible and I need to stop. So I decided to put my foot down. I've stopped. For the past four or five days now, I've had dual dragos, main hand ascension and off hand Celtic crossbow. Reason for that is I can still go next with the dry gores and ascensions, and though that pair, main hand ascension, off hand chaotic, is good enough for Araxi. It also means I have some cash, as you can see, for just um, supplies which I need. Um, it's useful to have this cash definitely because tomorrow is Tuesday, the 29th of March, the release date of God Wars Dungeon 2, also known as Heart of Gillenor. Fuck yeah! Can't wait, been waiting too long for that shit. I thought it was going to come out today, put some time aside for it. Nope, comes out tomorrow. That sucks. Um, but you know, I can't wait for that, uh, which is why I'm selling the Araxi loot tab now. I feel like I've done enough kills of Araxi in that one stint. It's time to go back to live recording, get some progress on the go. So as I said, I've been doing a lot of next kills, um, and I'm still dry. Still dry. I must be over 100 kills dry. I'm at least... 10 to 15 trips dry now uh, it's absolutely horrible absolutely horrible it's almost like you know why am I still going to this boss doesn't make me any money um, it sometimes pays for supplies and I have been getting kind of lucky with uh, onyx bolts there but I just have not got a single drop in so long it's just it's really demotivating so my Araxi kill count now stands at four, four, there, 458 I got my leg on, I think, 420. So, kind of drew another piece already. Another leg piece, according to everyone else's drop rate. Next, I'm now at 744. And I think the last time I showed that I was at 700 or 705, something like that. Ah, uh, yeah, that's... We don't speak of next anymore. That's, that's in the past now. So you can see I'm on 23 mil cash. I've got the main hand ascension. I've got the dual dry goals, I've got the Gravens, I've got the full Sirenic with Ascension Grips, the full Malevolent, and I've actually got to buy myself Razor Gaunt, uh, Razorback Gauntlets back because mine mine broke, which is you know great fun, right in the middle of the next trip. So that's that's kind of my setup at the minute, and it's going to be for a while. Hopefully I can make some money at God Wars Dungeon 2. Uh, I won't have time to do it much on release date, and you probably won't see much of it in this uh, video or the next video because I will be releasing separate videos about the update not much of it will be in uh, the actual road to rebuild series anyway that's enough rambling on uh, I'm explaining my situation so let's go boss now and please try and make some money hey guys so it's been a few days since I uh, recorded a tour and that's because Gordon's Dungeon 2 has just came out you may have seen that I've made a few videos on guides and you know, showing off God Wars Dungeon 2 already, um, but it's time to get back on to making Road to Rebuild episodes. So, I am about to go, uh, I don't know, God Wars Dungeon 2, yep, sounds good. I'm about to go Vindicta and Gorvec with Turlo, and we're going to see what we can do. The main reason for going here is um, to get, what's it called, to get the seals, um, so then we can get increased drop chance at Hellwear. And it's also just mixing it up a bit, you know, there's no point just camping Hellwear. Um, Hellwear is a lot of fun, but Vindicta is probably easier. It's really chill, Vindicta. Uh, there's two I haven't tried yet. Greg, who looks really hard. Well, not really hard, but just like, mm, too hard that I can be bothered with it. And the other one is the Twin Furies, which I thought would be really difficult because there's two of them. And you just kind of assume that when you see a, a two, two bosses in one room and shit, but... No, they actually seem okay. They don't seem too hard. So maybe we'll try the chin. Uh, chin? Maybe we'll try the uh, Twin Furies at some point as well. 
Um, my computer's making quite a lot of noise, so I don't want to record the drops in a minute. If I record, if I get a drop, of course I will record it. Other than that, I'll just record the splits at the end of the trip. So good luck, me. Okay, so we had to cut the first trip short. I had to go to dinner, so here's a quick price check of the first trip. Uh, not many kills at all, but still made 560k. Uh, that's before the split, so 200 and uh, 70, 80k each. Not bad. Um, for literally 10 minutes, 10 minutes. So. Yeah, pretty decent. Um, I'm going to go and gear up and just go get some kill cam while I'm waiting for Turlo to come back. And then when he's back, we will continue with Vindicta and Gorbeck because duo was fairly easy. Yes, boys. Dragon Rider Lance. Okay, that's what we wanted. That is my first drop from um, God Wars Dungeon 2 and first drop from Victin Vic Vindicta. Vin. Dicta, what's wrong with me? Um, so that's pretty cool. Uh, price check says it's 76 mil, so I'll probably sell it for about 200. No, I'm, I'm only fucking with you. I'm sure many of you know the price checks are completely wrong, and I think it's probably about 10 to 15 mil, which I'm you know, I'd be I'd be really happy with that. So, yeah, we're probably about 10 kills into this trip. That's cool. Let's keep going. Alright guys, so we finished up the trip and um, I just sold the Dragon Rider Lance for 25 mil, so I'm not at all annoyed with that. I was expecting 10 to 15 mil, 25 mil, I can I can deal with that. Um, so now I'm going to log off and scam these noobs, and that'll be the end of the video really. Uh, and basically we got 750k each, Turbo didn't want his items, so I've got his items and just gave him the cash. Um, so I'll do the cash splits with everyone. And uh, we'll see how much we come up to all in all. Hey guys, so sold everything. And here is the final price check. 9 mil from uh, 20 minutes. 9 mil. Yeah, it's not the best. I could probably do better at QBD. No, it's great. It's fucking amazing at the minute. Um, so that was Vindicta. And I think we're going to head over to Hellweir for a bit. Or maybe back to Vindicta. Can't decide. But either one of the two. Those are my two favourite. Those are the only two I've been to. Um, if we're Fiend Adventurous, we could actually go to Twin Furies, but yeah, we'll, we'll go back to God Wars Dungeon 2. Hey guys, just got another drop at Hell where it's a dormant um, Anima Core Helm. Uh, this one really is worth, like, nothing. Uh, as you can see, the helms are pretty pretty common. Just just before me, there was someone getting a helm somewhere else. Uh, just after me, there was someone getting a... Oh, that's a lance, but still... The helms are very common, and just the, the armor pieces in general. Um, we'll set it anyway, you know, it's a little bit to add on to the trip. It's like getting a, I don't know, Bandos Tassets or something, but cool, I guess. Um, would have preferred the wand, which is now 36 to 38 mil. But yeah, it's, it's just nice to get a drop, really. So I managed to sell that drop for 1 mil. It really is kind of like, eh, yeah, cool, but nothing more than that. So... Kind of a shame because I got quite excited um, before I knew what it was. I thought it may have been the wand or a crest. Or, you know, those two are really good. Um, but I can't complain. Let's just see it as like a one mil standard loot, which is good. Yeah. So this is the final split of um, of the trip. Um, I so with the seventy one k, it's about eight hundred. Fuck's sake, no space. Okay, it's about 820k each, um, so not bad. I think we're either going to go to Vindicta or back to White Hellwear. Maybe I, maybe Twin Furies, I don't know. I'm not sure if I'm ready to take the plunge yet. Hey guys, so right now I'm just splitting for the um, a short Vindicta trip that we just did. Trio again, me, Toto and Tom, so uh, yeah, this is all the loot here. It's not going to be a huge amount. Um, Get nine, but you know it's it's gonna be it's gonna be an alright amount, um, and we're probably gonna go back, I guess. Um, that's too many. That seems about right. Um, the only annoying thing with splitting the items from this boss is they're so awkward all the time. Um, they're really awkward numbers, so it's it's just not splittable really. But we do our best. We do our best. Um, how many more do you need? You know, I, I just kind of have to guess because I don't want to divide everything by three. That takes a while. Um, and kind of 50, 57 of them. I have 57 of them. And then is that's too much coal. 
see what I mean, guys? You see, you see what I have to deal with right now? This is this is not good. Um, but that three hundred K came from a Zamrockian essence or Zamrock essence. I can't remember how it is called, but um, that was all right. Was, yeah, three hundred K. It sold for and so a hundred K each. Yep, that seems about right. Um, so there we go. The split of, of that chip was five hundred K. Pretty standard for a very short amount of time, so that's cool. Uh, and yeah, I'll, I'll see you with the next lot of loot. Hey guys, so it's a bit later in the night now, which is why I haven't been recording so much. Uh, my laptop, well, no, my computer's going a bit crazy and the audio quality won't be as good, which is why I've kind of avoided it. But we were just at Twin Furries for the first time. Furries? Yeah, furries. That's what they are. Twin Furries. For the first time, and I managed to pick up a Blade of Avarice. This was a trio trip again, and pretty hyped, pretty fucking hyped, not gonna lie. Uh, that's the third drop today, so it's it's a good day. Um, I don't know how much to expect for this drop, so I'm gonna put it in for 30 mil, and then slowly go down and down, and just see how much it sells for. Alright, so that's a bit upsetting. 6 mil, that's, yeah, that's not great. Um, I mean, you know, it, it adds the trip a bit, but... I guess after getting the spear and selling that for 25 mil, I was a bit more hopeful uh, for the uh, for the sword, for the weapon, because it looks like an alright weapon. Um, but you know, it's it's whatever. Uh, okay, so I'll do splits now and see how much we actually made. From it. All right, here, so here are the uh, split from the standard loot, 540k. So all in all, the 25 minute trip we made 250. Sorry, no, 2.5 mil each. From from 25 minutes, that's pretty good. I'm happy with that. 